Today was the start of the next chapter for the American Semiconductor Leadership. That, according to our own Senator Chuck Schumer, he says it's happening right here, right now in the Capitol District. Our Dan Levy joins us here in the studio to talk about what it's all about and how it's going to impact all of us. Dan. Steve, good afternoon. This is extremely exciting news. Today, Nanotech marked a major milestone, establishing itself as the new global epicenter for advanced chip research and manufacturing. Senator Chuck Schumer did come to town today, and he brought with him $825 million, which he says creates the next frontier for the world's microchips in upstate New York. When they cut the ribbon on this new facility today, Schumer described it as a sonic boom that echoes from one end of the country and one end of the world to the other. Schumer says this new state-of-the-art facility at Albany Nanotech will help the United States establish worldwide dominance in advanced semiconductor research and development. A facility like this has never, never been done before. It's a revolutionary new effort for the federal government. And what it does is it brings together the nation's top scientists, universities, and companies all under one roof with the most advanced machinery in the world for chip making. And one of the unique things about Albany Nanotech is that it is the first public access EUV facility in the country. EUV standing for extreme ultraviolet lithography, which creates incredibly tiny patterns on silicon wafers, enabling the production of smaller, more powerful chips for devices like smartphones or computers. Yes, the AI revolution is underway and the capital region is at the forefront, Steve. Yeah, it's crazy stuff to look at because it's literally smaller than what the human eye can even see. Right. You gotta have like a super microscope sure. to go in there. But it sets the future of what all our stuff's you know using these Absolutely days. Absolutely remarkable. Mm -hmm. Who'd ever thought, right, years <laughs> ago that this was the type of stuff we'd be talking about. I mean, I mean you probably you you guys use a lot of those chips and just your forecasting material. It's all things. about the power, Steve. That's right. We have the, the best <laughs> equipment. We've got the first mm -hmm. warning weather lab, a lot of that stuff. The mm -hmm. technology is booming here. And uh, it's great to see that a lot mm -hmm. of that's gonna be local. Oh yeah.